A shifting focus amid the opposition's mockery of the Prime Minister Narendra Modi's Kanyakumari visit, the Tamil Nadu Congress is all set to approach the Election Commission over the matter. The Prime Minister will visit the Rock Memorial and will meditate at the Dhyan Mandapam from the 30th of May evening to the 1st of June in the evening. The TNCC chief has criticized the move, calling it drama staged before the final phase of the elections, which remembers right around the corner, they're slated for the first. Now, he says that the event violates the MCC as it could influence voters through continuous media coverage. The Prime Minister's meditation event will coincide with the last phase of elections on the 1st of June. And the Tamil Nadu Congress will also request the DGP to deny permission, citing potential disruptions to tourists over the next three days. We're crossing over to my colleague who joins us now. Varshini is on the broadcast with us. Uh, Varshini, you know, a war of words has now erupted over this. Can you tell us more about the significance of what the Tamil Nadu chief has had to say here? Well, absolutely, yes. Uh, the Tamil Nadu Congress Committee President Selva Perundagai has spoken about uh, the meditation plan of Prime Minister Narendra Modi at the Vivekananda Memorial Rock in Kanyakumari. And he's essentially stating in his statement that this is a clear violation of the moral code of conduct because right before the day of the final phase of elections, if the Prime Minister is going to go sit at uh, the rock and meditate, it is definitely going to draw a massive media attention, which in itself is a political uh, statement that the Prime Minister is giving in order to garner extra votes and he's also stated that uh, this is a drama that is being staged by the Prime Minister which is politically motivated and definitely not spiritually motivated and on the other hand uh, the Selva Parindika has also spoken about how uh, there should be a ban on this meditation plan of the Prime Minister because this is a tourist mm -hmm. place and it is a tourist spot the public will be disturbed since the Prime Minister is going to sit there and meditate there's going to be heavy uh, protocol that is going to be in place at the Vivekananda Memorial and people will be deprived of their basic rights to go visit the rock and also uh, he's also speaking about how uh, this is uh, not uh, something that the Prime Minister is doing really out of spirituality because his ideologies do not align with that of Swami Vivekananda and his disciples or people who follow his teachings will definitely be, uh, you know, uh, upset about the fact that the Prime Minister is doing this to gain a political uh, mileage is what uh, the uh, Tamil Nadu Congress Committee Chief has essentially stated at this point of time. And he also says that nobody uh, can be denied the right to meditate. The Prime Minister can and go and meditate, but not when moral code of conduct is in place, is what he's essentially stating in a statement. Therefore, the, uh, it is expected that the TNCC will approach the Election Commission of India and they will definitely file a complaint with the ECI regarding this matter, as per his statement. All right. All right, Varshini, thank you so much for joining us and telling us more.